What's happening everybody, MG here, MG Carvers, bringing you a brand new handicapping video. Today we're gonna do something a little bit differently. We're gonna review a sports betting site called oddstrader.com. Really good site. Uh, we're gonna do a complete review, give you everything I like about it, some things I don't like about it. Um, so it's a really good resource for anyone that's aspiring to be a professional handicapper or improve your handicapping. Really good site overall. Before we do that, as always, don't forget to like this video, subscribe to the channel. If you're wanting to improve your sports betting, get better at sports handicapping, you're at the right place. Um, also, follow me on social media. You'll get a ton of value just simply by following me, not because I'll get more followers. I send out a ton of free content on Instagram, on my storyline, some things I see. Um, I give free tips, uh, advice about something I see in the marketplace. You can benefit a lot from just simply following me there. And the screen name for that is MG Covers, covered spell with a Z. With that out of the way, let's dive right into it. Now, the way that I teach sports, uh, sports handicapping uh, is you need a resource to be able to see, understand, and see line movement where the public is playing, uh, where, where the where the public money is, where the public money is not. And oddstrader.com gives you all of that information. And the wonderful thing about oddstrader is it is absolutely free, which I love. Now, um, what I want to do is this is the uh, web page. Now, they actually have an app. I haven't used the app. I haven't downloaded the app. Probably will end up using the app. But uh, from just a desktop perspective, it's really good and has everything that we need. And so what I want to do is let's just dive into it. Let's click on NBA. And you can see here, uh, this is the Boston-Philadelphia matchup for today. Boston is getting 91% of the tickets, which we need to see this information, um, the way that I teach. And Philadelphia is getting 9%. <clears throat> and then the way that I teach about line movement, you can see Boston is getting... 91% of the tickets, and they're also getting majority of the money on them as well. How do we know this? He, uh, Odds Trader lists the opening line, which is plus five. Now that line has moved down to four and a half. What makes a line move? Money makes a line move. So we know that we have the majority of tickets on Boston and the majority of money on Boston. That's what's made this line move. And you can see here the web, uh, the, uh, information they're pulling from bet mgm bet 365 sports bet and some of these popular ones if those of you that live in states where it's legal draft draft kings william hill and FanDuel. so just right there you have everything that you need uh, to assess line movement where public money is where public not you know you have everything you need right there now one other cool little detail if we actually click on this it will pull up this little, uh, am I going to end up being in the way here? Actually, I am. Let me see if I can scroll down. Okay. So you get this information over here. Now, if you click on injuries, if I'm not mistaken, somebody told me this, they have, it looks like, and if you're the owner odds trader, you can correct me, but I think this is linked into RotoWire. And again, as far as injuries, that's something else I teach. It's very important. You have to stay on top of injuries. And you can see here, it gives you a brief synopsis. Uh, Tatum, COVID-19, will not travel to Philadelphia for t games Wednesday and Friday. Um, shows if they're out. Uh, same deal with Philadelphia. Injury is very important for all sports, but very important for NBA. And also, too, one other cool little detail when, when you click here. Let me make sure you know how to do this. So all I did was I simply clicked here. And then you go to line history, and it actually shows line movement, so you get an idea where uh, that line's going. And we've already talked about this. You can see uh, opened at five and a half. It shows the updates, five and a half, eight forty three. It goes to four and a half, and it's currently at four and a half. So that's important to see the direction of the line movement, and specifically because that's I, I teach that uh, following line movement in certain cases, not a hundred percent of the time, but a large majority of the time. Okay, and another thing that I like about the site, the way it's laid out, you can see here, just one click, like I'm an MBA, one click, and I can immediately go to, I don't have to click twice. I mean, I can make one click, and I'm here at uh, NCAA Basketball. And the same deal here. Scroll down, and again, it's got every, everything that you need here. Now, I'm going to go back to MBA real quick. 
and let's click on let's just do another one let's click on this dallas indiana game or before we do that you can look up here where it says ats standings if you click there it's pretty cool it gives you ats uh, against the spread now i don't teach um the way that I teach, we don't follow actual ATS spreads. We use this information to see how a team is valued in the marketplace because the way I teach against the spread, you take the actual line for that game and add that to their last five games. That gives you a true sharp against the spread. What we use this for to determine how they're valued in the marketplace. When you see Chicago's 10 and 4, this means they're undervalued in the marketplace. Um, they're 10 and 4. And if you keep scrolling down here, let's find a team like uh, Miami, for instance, or even Houston. They're very overvalued in the marketplace, which means a lot of people are playing Miami. They're actually uh, not covering 4 and 7, Houston 4 and 8. So, one thing to it list that's real important they list form. Okay. And so, if we click here, let's scroll. Whoop. Let's go to match up and we scroll all the way down to the bottom and it shows the last one, two, three, four, five, last five games. What do I teach to focus on the last five games? So now the only thing I don't like, uh, if I trader, if you're watching this and you're the owner, you can see where you list, you actually have it listed backwards there. That's not their most recent. It should read left to right. Um, like it is here. So you can see San Antonio, still good information. San Antonio has won three of their last five. You can scroll down here. Whoops. And you can see Golden State has won three of their last five, um, beat the Lakers. So it gives you, um, so you got form. So if you think about some of the things that I teach, we can, we can check form from here. Uh, we can check line movement. We can check injuries. So it's, again, just a really, really good resource. Uh, has a lot of uh, information that that we need now also too. let's go back to the game i'll show you this okay so so we're looking at these spread lines we can go up here you click spread and click money and it will immediately give you all the money lines for all the sports as well so overall it's a, it's a really good site it has all the information that you want and again too if you look over here if you want to actually sign up for account and uh, I guess track your bets. I'm not sure that's exactly what this is, but I'm pretty sure that's what it is. So you can actually track your, you can sign up for a free account, uh, track your bets, um, which is a good way to stay organized. So uh, if you're looking for a site that has um, the breakdown of the money, the tickets, uh, the oddstrader.com is a very good site. And one thing that I wish they would improve on, like you look here, this is the result. Let me show you this here, back to spread. Okay. Uh, again, if you're the owner, odds trader, love to see this where you show like here, we need to see the money on these past games. You know, where, where did the money close? Was the majority of tickets, I mean, tickets, uh, was the majority of tickets on Oklahoma city, Denver, they list it before the game, but they don't show it post game. And the reason that's important, especially for my clients and the way that I, I, um, do my research, you, you could never use a site for back testing because you don't have. Um, the tickets listed here. So I'd love to see that there. Other than that, it's a really good site. It's got everything that you need. Um, I think the app would probably be just as good. Again, I haven't tested it, so I don't know that. But anyway, oddstrader.com, excellent site. I actually need to give props. I think one of my clients actually recommended this site uh, to me. So whoever that is, I tip my hat to you. It's a really good site. And the other one, I don't want to mention it just because I'm just focusing on this one. It's just as good. I still like it. Um, the lines are very comparable. And the other site, you have to remember, even though they show most of the offshore books, they still run their lines parallel with what happens at Pinnacle. Pinnacle is probably the sharpest offshore book. And then a lot of these books you see up here will run parallel with what Pinnacle's doing. So they're very close as far as, um, you know, public, non-public teams, seeing where the money goes, seeing where the line moves. So they're all relative, relatively the same. But I just, I, I do tend to use Odds Trader more than the other site. Okay, with that out of the way, uh, don't forget, as always, if you want to become a client, you have access to all of my uh, coaching videos, all of my lines for all sports, 
uh, all of my coaching videos on the website. You can get that for $29.95 per month. Uh, right now we're handicapping NBA and showing you my lines for NBA and NCAA basketball. We'll have NHL power rankings here probably about February the 5th, February the 10th, somewhere in there after teams have played 10 games. So you get access to my lines that I use to handicap the games, uh, $29.95 per month. And if you would like to have everything I just mentioned, all of that coaching videos, all my power rankings, in addition to my plays for all sports, that is $49.95 per month. And if you want to join for an entire year, which is the best value, if you take this 50 bucks a month here times 12, that's $600. And if you cut that in half, uh, that is 300 bucks. You can actually join for an entire year for $299. So 50% savings if you sign up for the entire year. And before we leave, I'm going to show you a good little run we've had here in sports. This is one, two, three, last four days. Uh, we're on an eight and four run, some college basketball mixed in with some NBA. And what's interesting to point out, I always talk about value, playing money line dogs. We've played five money line dogs in college basketball. James Madison, uh, Western Kentucky, Tulsa, Gramlin State, Pittsburgh. We've hit four out of five of those dogs. Gives you a, um, a ton of value, a ton of, quote, extra money by doing that. Uh, Pittsburgh, last night, we hit them at plus 170. Played it at another book at plus 164. Our line for that Pittsburgh matchup was minus... God, I think we had Pittsburgh minus 16. And same deal with this Utah Jazz. They were uh, minus six sports book. I think our line was minus 15 or 16 as well, somewhere in there. So play Miami, lost that one, but still up with a very profitable day. So that's it for now. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. Again, oddstrader.com, great resource. And we will talk to you guys soon. Peace.